Welcome to Tinkernut.com's videocast. If you have any questions, please email me at admin at Tinkernut.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a hidden user account in Windows XP. And you'll either need an existing account that you want to change to a hidden account, or you can go to Control Panel and User Accounts and just create a new account. I created one called Hidden User for obvious reasons. So now what you'll need to do is go to Start, Run, and type in RegEdit to get to the Windows Registry. And be very careful what you do in here because if you change something that's not supposed to be changed, it could mess up your system. But you want to go to H key Local Machine, Software, and then Microsoft, and then scroll down till you find the Windows NT folder, and then the current version folder, and then scroll down until you find the Win Logon folder, and then go to the Special Accounts folder and User List. And in the right hand window, right click, go to New D Word Value and then type in the name of the user that you want to hide. Now if you right click on this and select modify you can either put the value of 0 for hidden or 1 for visible. So we're gonna leave this one as 0 and click OK. Now if you go back to control panel and user accounts you'll see that that user is no longer visible. And also if you log off of the current user that you're under, you'll see that on the login screen it's not visible either. To access it you have to hit Control alt delete twice and type in that hidden user account. And under this hidden user account, if you go to Control Panel and User Accounts, you can see it here, but you won't be able to see it as any other user. That's it for this tutorial. For more, go to Tinkernut.com.